What's up everybody, welcome back to another video, my name is Tim Poas and today we'll be looking at how to record your PC screen for free and this is a collab with Edmondson, I'm not sure if I can say his name properly but if I can't just comment down below and sorry for the background noise guys, I'm terribly sorry so yeah guys, go check out his channel, he does do tutorials just like me, he has the same content as me, his link will be down below go drop him a subscribe guys and if you do want to win a collab like we just did right now, that made any sense then all you have to do is drop a like on this video, turn on my notifications subscribe and comment down below i want to collab and also comment on his video i'll be checking his video a lot his newest video say hashtag tempo art sent me and yeah guys that is how you're gonna get a collab with me and yeah guys peace out subscribe like let's hit 50 likes peace out how is it going everyone Evanson here and today guys i'm going to be teaching you boys how you can record your pc screen for free in 2017 so if you want to find out stay tuned Hermes link ice blue mix so the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the, like, the top link in the description. It will say OBS download. You want to go click on that. Then it will redirect you to this website right here. Should look pretty similar to like this unless they've updated it since I've made this video. But anyway, you're seeing a big green box in the middle of the page almost. Download install it. You just want to go ahead, click on that. And then as you will see in the bottom left, it will start to download. So I'll be back with you in a minute once it's downloaded. Okay, so as you can see, it's now downloaded. You just want to go ahead and click on it. And then just go through all this, allow it to make changes to the computer, it's not a virus or anything. Just want to keep going through a step, just click next, I agree, next, and then go ahead and click install. And as you'll see, it will start to install the actual program. So once again, I'll be back when this is downloaded. Okay, so now that's downloaded, just want to tick launch OBS Studio and go ahead and click finish. So now OBS will now launch. So as you can see, it's now launched, you just got a black screen and then all of this. This is my mic and all that recording, just ignore all that for the minute. Okay, so as you can see, you've got sources there and then scenes there. The first thing you want to do, you have to do the same for sources, but make sure you do it to scenes first, because you've got to have a scene to be able to do a source. So you want to go over to scenes, click the little plus here, name it whatever you want, for for the sake of arguments, I'm just going to put to, I spelled it wrong, oh god, tutorial, saying this is a tutorial video. So you, just, you can name it whatever you want, then you want to come over to sources, click the add, then display capture, then just go ahead, click OK, after you click OK on that, it will bring up another pop-up menu. As you can see, it says display zero. So because I've got one monitor, it'll say display zero. So if you've got one monitor for your PC, it will say display zero. If two, just click on the one above it, do whatever you want. So that just depends on how many monitors you got. So if I was you, I just leave it on the defaults on what it stays on. And then you want to choose whether you want the cursor on your screen, like the little mouse thing or not. I don't mind it, so I'm just going to keep it ticked. And now I'm going to go ahead and click OK. So as you can see, you can now see my PC screen in the background, and basically, all you've got to do like a few more little steps, basically simple steps now, and then you can start recording your PC screen. So you want to go over to Settings, Output, choose right here where it says Recording Path, you want to browse and select where you want like your recordings to go to, so I've just got it on my desktop, so when I record a video on OBS, it just goes straight to my desktop. Next thing you want to do is you can choose your recording quality. I would keep it on, I can't say that word, Instinct, I don't even know, but it's the best quality you can get, so put it on the third one down, I would 100% recommend that. And then you want to change the recording format from FLV to MP4, that's one of the main things, make sure you do that. So once you've got all them steps down, you just want to go ahead, click OK, and now all you need to do is just click Start Recording, and then you're ready to start recording your videos. So guys, I'll give you a quick example now, I'm just going to click Start Recording, leave it for a few seconds then stop recording and as you can see it's gone over to my desktop over here I just click on it and you may hear a little bit of an echo but oh well I'm gonna click on it now and preview this pretty boring video yeah I know pretty boring few seconds of my life watching that but oh well anyway guys it's been Edmondson leave a thumbs up if this tutorial helped you subscribe if you're new comment what I should do next share this video on Google Plus on Twitter Sherry.com anything be much appreciated it's been your boy Edmondson and I'll see you guys in the next one peace